Right now, Wisconsin businesses and political leaders are celebrating a $49 million grant from the federal government. That money will boost Wisconsin's biohealth industry and create thousands of jobs. JT Siskowski has you covered on how this money makes Wisconsin a crucial part of America's economic security. Tens of millions of dollars may soon create tens of thousands of jobs in places like where I am, the University Research Park on Madison's west side. As Wisconsin's biohealth industry finds itself catapulted into global competition to help bolster America's domestic production. The $49 million federal grant for Wisconsin's tech hub will be added to millions more in state and private funding, all to boost Wisconsin's biohealth industry creating an estimated 30,000 jobs. The federal money is intended to spur American industry and make the country less dependent on foreign powers. Lisa Johnson is one of Wisconsin's tech hub leaders. We're just really extremely proud to be representing the United States in this initiative, the Tech Hub's initiative, to really protect national and economic security and to deliver global competitive, competitiveness to the United States in the years to come. Wisconsin has traditionally been associated with agriculture and manufacturing. State leaders like Wisconsin Economic Development Secretary Missy Hughes hope the new money makes Wisconsin synonymous with biohealth. What we're really seeing is an opportunity to take this manufacturing industry and apply it to biohealth. And so the opportunities are really exciting and, you know, the rising tide lifts all boats. And there's more money where that came from. The federal government has set aside billions of dollars to invest in domestic production. Tuesday's announcement was only for about $500 million of that, so Wisconsin could be seeing the benefits from these federal investments for years to come. In Madison, J.T. Siskowski, 27 News.